Sharpton, defunding the New York police is something a latte liberal may go for as they sit around the Hamptons discussing this as an academic problem. But the people living on the ground, they need proper policing. Hmm. Do, do I agree with Al Sharpton once in a million years? What is this? Do you think it's as safe as it's been? Uh, or, or are you seeing the New York City security fray at the edges? We've always heard about the tale of two cities on the side of the city that I come from, <clears throat> which is blacker and, and poorer. Uh, we've seen more uh, in terms of gun uh, usage. Uh, you know, I got a lot of attention when I did the eulogy for George Floyd's funeral. But I also a month later preached a one year old kid's funeral in Brooklyn who uh, was killed by uh, a stray bullet. So we're seeing both. Six people were shot over this uh, Labor Day weekend at a festivity in Brooklyn. So uh, I would say statistically, we're not much higher than we were. But on the ground, it is certainly feeling more violent, feeling more unsafe in unsafe communities, if you know what I mean. I'm talking about in communities where we were uh, somewhat having to deal with more crime. It feels more uh, in, in many ways uh, dangerous. And the, and the fact that you have people that are disproportionately essential workers that have had to go to work, they did not have the summer or the pandemic off. So it has been in stressful areas slightly more stressful. I don't think the headlines are exactly right. I think they embellish it, but clearly uh, those that feel the worst has gotten even a worse feeling during this pandemic. Uh, pause for fair use. We're halfway through the clip. Uh, uh, so I disavow all the m mad things Al Sharpton's ever said. I'm not saying I agree with him completely. Just there's one little thing he's going to say here that's slightly rational. Grouping numbers isn't bad for going to math in your head. I think it's cool to learn both. Grouping numbers doesn't show your work through the linear math. They don't prove they don't cheat. Oh, that's what it was about. Yeah, I was always doing math in my head when I was a kid. Now I get in trouble for not showing my work. Demic period in New York. And, and I, I hear the fears of, of again, the defunding the police or cutting the police budget by a billion dollars in New York City will disproportionately impact who? The poorest uh, uh, people in New York City and also disproportionately impact people of co color, Rev, uh, with school safety monitors being yanked out of there and other uh, other uh, police officers that certainly many uh, people of color and their representatives in New York City feel are. You know who's brought up race so far in this conversation? This white guy. Mr. Sharpton over here never brought up race. He said poor communities. Or communities affected by crime. He never said race, people of color. The people making this racialized right now is the white leftists in the center of the screen. Essential workers themselves. I, I've said, uh, uh, and you and I have discussed this, we need to reimagine how we do policing. But when you are talking about the fact that, A, we are in the areas where that is inundated with guns, that has this uh, serious problems of our uh, people being given guns that can't even get a summer program. To take all policing off is something that I think uh, a latte liberal may go for as they sit around the Hamptons discussing this as some academic problem. But people living on the ground need proper policing. Yes, we need more uh, resources in different areas like mental health, but we do not need our grandmothers Pray to those that are being the uh, users of products of the big gun manufacturers in this country. Well, also with us this morning. He did say poor black gray areas. Maybe I missed it, your mother. Maybe I did miss it. Damn. I was hoping that I was right, but you know what? I'm wrong. I'll, I'll admit when I'm wrong, when I'm wrong. Uh, so, hey, latte liberals trying to defund the police. Al Sharpton has a black card. He's saying no. Will BLM listen to him? No. Bro, I don't know if they're going to bring him back on the show anymore if he's going to be talking like that. 